What is going on, Chaotix? It is your boy Chaos May 006 here, and we are back with week number six of the week number six, week number eight of the PDL season three uh, US ball. Okay, I want to see what he said. Uh, versus the new Rhode Island Radicate that's on the screen. I can't even read it. So, what is his lead here? Um, it's a good question. He does not bring the big boy that I was really worried about. Which is uh, a really two big boys I'm not worried about. Uh, Alolan Ninetales, I mean Alolan Persian, and um, no, everything else comes. Alolan Persian does not come, which is nice to see. Uh, we do see a Slurpuff and a Hitmon Top, so Hitmon Top is going to be a bit of a problem. But we do have some things to take it on. Slurpuff also is a pain in the butt, but we can take it out as well. I predict the uh, Raquinid lead trying to get us to lower the stuff. So uh, I have. If I have calced this correctly, which I think I have, um, Thunder Punch should be able to take it out. It might not, but it should be able to do a lot of damage anyway. So I'm going to go with Ali as my lead. Designated lead here, uh, what we're going to hit. So, of course, Mega Venusaur, Volcarona, Thunderous, Slurpuff, Araquanid, and Hitmon, and Hitmon Top. So uh, this is a good lead for us. We just click Thunder Punch. This is what we want to see. Um, could have led Jackie here. We can see a Thunderous coming in. That would be a pain in the butt. I want to see what we do to a Thunderous. Thunderous, we do... Thunder Punch is doing 50, so Thunder Punch is a nice way to deal with you. So I'm just going to hit click Thunder Punch. Get a nice cheeky damage off of you. I have Papa Berry. Interesting. Liquidation. We live a Liquidation, so that's fine. So we did 76%. So I just click it again. I just click it again and take him out. Uh, good set for him. Good set to you. Good set. Bring in the Mega Venusaur. That's okay. Give me the Parrot. No? Okay, what do we deal with Mega Venusaur here? Uh, Jackie can deal with it. Uh, Maximus can deal with it. Uh, Toxic looks like a good stall here, so I think Maximus is the play. Uh, Earthquake could... How much is a... Uh, uh, Venusaur? Mega Defensive... Um, he's not built with any special attack, so if he's building Earthquake, uh, just 45, so not great, but we can bring a Maximus here. Predicting, predicting, predicting the bit, the bit, the bit, the words. Psychic is 60%, so I think I just, I'm not worried about this, I don't think yet, so I'm going to Stealth Rock. Cause problems for the rest of his team. It might come down to the point where Stealth Rocks is the way to beat this. So it does 50% to Volcarona, does 25 to Thunderous, does 25 to uh, um, what should we call it? Uh, it's 25 to Arachnid. So he's gonna sit here, Leech Seed. I'm okay with this actually. Maximus actually does this pretty well here. Just sitting here, and we can just get some damage off on Jungle Gym. He's going to try to synthesis stall me, which is a play here. Which is a play. What do I want to do to break the synthesis stall? Do I come in with Metacham here and go against Mega Venusaur? i got to figure out what I need to do here. Sludge Bomb does a lot, but if we get... Um, if we get some nice damage on this thing, we can do it so... Um, we can bring a Metacham and get rid of the Leech Seed as well. So Maximus is really going to be putting in some work. He can't touch me. He can't touch me. He doesn't have any... He doesn't have anything to touch me with. Does he? He's got Sludge Bomb. And he can't touch me with Sludge Bomb. He doesn't have a, like any other move on, attacking move on. That would be... That's great. Because even if I am seated, it's got a 38% chance to Oko after a Leech Seed recovery. There's a crit that we need. Giga Drain doing nothing, and now we just take it out. That's what we want to see, Jirachi. There you go. It's 57. Ooh, 57 is going to be putting it close. But Jirachi just puts in the work right now on this Mega Venusaur. And we have other things to deal with the Hitmonchan, the Hitmon Top. I'm not worried about it. Um, but uh, Jirachi just can put in the work here against Mega Venusaur. Okay, all right, we're in a pretty nice spot here, pretty controlling spot. 
Because even if he does switch out, he's switching into something else, and who wants to take a um, shot from Maximus right now? I don't really think anybody does. Um, Thunderous probably might be a good shot. Uh, no, Thunderous still takes 50%, but we would be under 50 at that point. So I don't know if Thunderbolt would kill us. It would be close. It would be a Calc. Volcarona would be a good switch in right now. Volcarona would be a great switch in to take me on. Um... Yeah, Volcarona would be great to take me on, but then at that point, I think I just switch into Gyarados, and this is the Mega, no, Volcarona. Volcarona's going Flamethrower, it does 20, it does 17%, uh, so I can go ahead and set up. So I, if he switches out the Volcarona, which is a good play for him, I can come in with Gyarados and just get a plus one set up. And at that point, his big things to take me out would be Thunderous, which can't do it because it, it, I had outspeed. Um, other things to deal with Mega Gyarados, Venusaur again, but we would have the power at plus one. He goes to hit him on top. He's going to take the L here, Intimidate, Leech Seed. I mean, I'm just going to, that's a good question here. I did not expect this switch. Uh, hit him on top. Rapid spin set, uh, even if he, he had to be max speed at this point to want to take me on, and so he's got to be max speed. Uh, close combat does a lot, but we should kill. What do we hit him with? Well, we can check we can check the set by seeing how much psychic does. It does 57%, so he's very specially defensive. It means he probably, he has leftover, so he's got to be at least, so he's got to be max special defense. He's going to be max special defense, a special defense in nature. So probably careful nature. And that does 59%. That calc is not correct. I'm just going to go psychic here. I don't think he switches out. Like, I find it hard. He has to be... He's got to be max max. And something must be calc wrong on my Jirachi. Fake out's fine. Not really, but fake out is fine. Is Moonblast doing more? Psychic's doing more. I just keep clicking Psychic. Because honestly, I'm not worried about Venusaur now that it's chipped down. I'm not worried about uh, dealing with anything else. Honestly, the only thing that Jirachi would deal with that I'm worried about would be the Slurpuff. But we still have ways to deal with that, and I'm not too worried about it. Um, as much as I want to go for a whole 6 0 sweep here, I don't think it's the play. I think Maximus sitting here just take, putting in some damage is a good play to get even if I go down 6-5 I think I can come back and do a nice uh, return later on getting a nice W because Jirachi just does a lot of Jirachi he doesn't have anything that wants to come in and fight it the thing that comes in and fight it right now is Thunderous and that would be his best switch is let's go straight to Thunderous right now uh, but I can predict Focus Blast I can not predict Focus Blast and just keep staying in Predict Thunderbolts, go for Garchomp. You know, there's a lot of different options here for this set. Uh, Ninetales is not looking too great at the moment. It would be something to maybe help out with... Slur there's the Slurpuff, okay? Okay, you can't do much to me. Slurpuff. Uh, Drain Punch is 17 to 20%. Uh, we're taking a good bit of chunk here. I think I just, uh, literally, what does Jirachi want to, like, what do I not, what do I do here? I mean, he's just getting everything weakened down. He could go, Drain Punch looks like a good solid play, play rough. He's got, he's probably outspeeding me. Um, Drain Punch, even with Drain Punch Recovery, he gets max roll, it's 11% back to him. We still kill, so the Psychic is the play, flamethrower. Good tech. Alright, Jirachi goes down. Um, flamethrower is outspeeding me, so it is 267. It's got to be max speed, most likely. Um, at this point. At this point, I need 267. I need to beat 267. Garchomp does not give me that. Um, Ninetales does give me that. Ninetales gives me that, but nothing else really does. Um, what is a Slurpuff doing to my nine tails? Jirachi, you're, you did it, your work, Jirachi. I appreciate you. Slurpuff, it does have flamethrower. 
That is to know. Flamethrower. Uh, Flamethrower. Let's try a max special attack stat. Let's see what he does. It does 41% here. Um, Drain Punch would do bet. Yeah, play it off and do more. Uh, that's a good question. I need to look and see Slurpuff's moves, because he built a really weird Slurpuff set this week, which is cool. I didn't expect it to be Billy Drum, if it's anything. He does have Thunderbolt, so that is not a good play. So Thunderbolt for Flame, we know he has Flamethrower, he's probably got Thunderbolt for Gyarados, I would assume. Um, he's got to have a Fairy type move, probably got Play Rough Sing on him, he's probably Mixed, or Dazzling Gleam, maybe in minus attack stack, get Dazzling Gleam. Uh, he's got to be faster than me, so... Um, he's got to be 267. What do we say it was? He's, uh, oh, I just got rid of the Rashi set. That was perfect. I need to keep, need to not get rid of my sets when I'm doing matches because uh, it's not helping me out. So Jirachi, give me back my set for Maximus. He's got to be 26, 236 speed. Um, a max speed Slurpuff is running a 267. So I want to beat the 267. You did not beat that. You do not beat that. You do not. I think the only play that beat this is Nine Tails. So Nine Tails is my play. Give me Snow Warning. Um, so obviously here, what's going to come in? Um, it would make sense to see the Hitmonchan come in and try to take us on. It would also make sense to see the uh, Volcarona come in and take us on. Do I go Hypnosis? Do I play Cheeky and go Hypnosis? Predicting because I think. I think I think it's uh, I think he switches into Volcaro Slurpuff I mean it does 50% to us but we can still take it out even if we miss so I think a good Volcarona we bring it in we get put it to sleep which would be awesome um, that would be nice so I could predict switch go nasty plot plus two and do some damage I could predict the Volcarona switch in I think the Volcarona is coming in which is okay. Uh, I think... Or do I just damage? Do I just get damage? Ooh, it's, it's, a, it's a tough call right now. I'm gonna go Hypnosis. Got to sleep, okay. That's fine. So we weaken that every single turn. Now I just get Nasty Plot. Now I just get to Nasty Plot up. Wait, 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 wait. Volcarona is a great switch in right now. I'm gonna go Gyarados. Am I reading this too hard? That's the thing. Am I reading this too hard? Because Volcarona's doing seven. Yeah, I'm Gyarados. Or Metacham, one of the two. Cause what? Cause we we take everything with Metacham, so Metacham is the play. Sweet. All right, that's what we want to do. So we set it up nicely for Metacham to just come in here. Switches to Mega Venusaur, perfect for me. We get a nice switch. Um, I can walk into Zen Head, but do I predict the Thunder is coming in right now? I don't really want to take a shot from Venusaur, do I? So Metacham just might win me this game right now. Mega Venusaur, uh, 74, we kill it easily. Uh, Sludge Bomb is 51, yeah, we just Zen Headbutt, not, don't worry about it. Just Zen Headbutt. So we got six turns of hail left to go up. Um, it is hailing. Let me make sure that we are going to take one sixteenth of our health every single time. As you can see, that is six percent of my health. So that is nice to do. Oh my gosh, nice read. Man, I love playing against this guy because he just, me and him, just great. He's a good friend of mine. I gotta say, and he's got great reads. So Slurpuff comes in, gonna take the the. I'm gonna take the death there. Good sack. There's a good sack for him. Gets rid of the Slurpuff. So Metacham kills Slurpuff. Nice to know. Alright, so what else do we got? Ooh. Tough play here. We have good We have a good chance against everything. I don't know what the Iraq one it's sitting at, but it's I think 71. Um uh, we know it is pretty powerful. It did what to my hit? It did what to my hit on Chan? That's a good question. What did it do to my hit? It did a lot to my hit on Chan. 
I want to look at uh, Araquanin. Did I think it did 70, so it can't be the uh, totem set. I think it might be the lead with the splat. Yeah, it's, it's got to be the uh, Sticky Web lead set with um, Sticky Web lead set with uh, Liquidation because it does uh, 60. I think you got min a, min a mid roll at like 72 or 73 percent, which uh, Liquidation would do 86 to 81 percent with that slot. So I think I got him. I think I got him pretty nicely I got him pretty nicely right now like his best bet to deal with me at this moment would be to come in with Volcarona and try to set up but again I have rock tomb for that um, Venusaur goes down thunderous would be a way to deal damage to Metacham so if let's see Metacham's up if thunderous comes in let's see what that does thunderous can do 80 uh, we hit we get to do a, a nice rock tomb so we can do 60% to us from here, which puts us at 20. And then Volcarona could come in. We would be at 20, like, would be about 20, less than that, probably about 15%. Volcarona could come in and just take us out with Flamethrower. But at that point, I would just switch in it to, uh, to Gyarados. So Thunderous would be the best play right now. But I think I got this game in a nice set for me. We did have to lose Jirachi, that's a sad thing. But I knew a 6-0 win this week was not the best play in the world. So he does bring in the Thunderous. Uh, Nasty Plot Thunderous set to 67% with, to me. I am specially defensive with Assault Vest. 78% we might actually just Oko with Rock Tomb or Zen Headbutt. Um, so either way, that would be great. Um, your max attack, what if we give you a Modest Nature just to give you the attack boost? 70, yeah, we're fine. I'm going to go Rock Tomb. I want to hit, I want to make sure I hit though. Um, Rock Tomb is 78. Send my headbutt 78. I just go rock tomb. I'm gonna go rock tomb. Even if we don't kill, we get the speed drop, which is great, which gives us a chance to stay around. So I gotta hope it hits. And we get speed drop, if anything. But actually, hold on one second. Before I before I lock myself into a move that I'm gonna get killed with. Thunderous. What moves do you get? You don't get Hurricane, which is great. You're only... So you'd have to have HP flying. Let me go that calc. Let me go that calc route. So if you have Hidden Power flying instead of Hidden Power... I think you have Ice, what it usually calcs as. Hidden... I mean, Hidden Power flying, 83%. So if he's... Ooh, do I play this? If he's Hidden Power flying, more power to him. I'm going to click Rock Tomb. If he's hidden power flying, more power to him, but I don't think he is. I think he's ice for Garchomp. He's Thunderbolt, that's fine. 46. Rock Tomb hits, he's dead. Good play. 40, we're sitting 37%. Volcarona still comes in and beats us. 37%. He's we're sitting on the on the bottom of the threshold there. 37%, it's gonna he gets the Oko. And we're in hail, so we can't beat a Volcarona right now. Which is okay. It's okay we can't beat a Volcarona. I got Gyarados for that. I got Gyarados to just come in and set up. So, that is fine by me. <laughs> I love this guy. I just love this guy. He's great. He's such great. We, like, this is the most I've talked in a chat while battling of someone. So, I really appreciate... Um, my man clinically insane over here or you would you know him as neurotic neutral gaming uh, if you want to go look at this guy <laughs> if you want to go look at this guy uh, his link is in the description I will mention it I will mention it again at the end of the video but uh, neurotic neutral gaming is who we're battling right now he's the coach and his link is in the description down below he's a great guy go check him out as you can see we're having pretty great banter in the chat uh, there goes the fidget spinner again intimidate Ooh. -hoo. Oof! Oof! Him on top. What have we discussed from him on top? Uh, well, the only w if it let's he's got to be specially defensive. Even with the fake out, he takes it down very little. So we just get to take out the hitmonchop here. I think that is a good play. 
Um, even if he has max speed, he, d he can outspeed if he's max speed, but I know he's got to be specially defensive. So, uh, and fake out's not doing that much anyway, so I'm just going to go ahead and click Zen Headbutt, get the sucker. Oh, he sucker punched! Good play. Ooh, sucker punch. Good play. I didn't think about that, but that's okay. Um, Manda Sham goes down too. Not great for my differential. Him on top. What beats it? Uh, Gertrude beats it. Nicely. So we see the sucker punch. We see the fake out. We know it's probably got close combat and rapid spin. So I need something to come in and hit it from 50%. Um, Jackie is gone, so I can't use that. Death Wish doesn't do it. Maximus d is dead, so it doesn't help. Um, what about Lola Ninetales? What about Nolan Ninetales Psy Shock? Alright, Metacham, Ninetales. Alola Ninetales hits Mon top. Rapid Spin. Uh, Psy Shock is 20. Ooh. Psy Shock is 26%. To 31%. So that's not going to do enough. Dang it, why do you have to be so weak, Alola Ninetales? Uh, him on Chan is too too weak at the moment. I think if him on Chan does come in, I think I quick or I have to quick earthquake at that point. Let's check what him on Chan can do. I might want to waste out uh, him on top rapid spin. I he can't be like he lived a shot. He's got to be. Max special defense. I don't think he's got enough investment. 30. Even with the band, 35%. If we take the band off. Yeah. We have band. So with the band damage, we're getting 21% back. Uh, 21 on to. We're getting 20. We're getting 18% back. 18 on the 37 would give us fi just over 50, which gives us just enough to live. So if we're faster, we can take him out. And honestly, what else is Hitmonchan going to do this match? So let's bring in Hitmonchan. Uh, he gets rid of rocks. That's not a great play, but we got Gertrude to deal with the rest of it. Garchomp also sitting in the back nicely, waiting for its moment to strike, so that's nice. Uh, I'm going to go Drain Punch, see if I outspeed. If not, Sucker Punch isn't doing much to me, I don't think. Sucker Punch does 8 to 9%, even if he is if he's no attack. He could be max attack, 252. 252 does 12 percent, um, but that means he would have to be non-HP invested, and that would give us a chance to just take him out and down here. So uh, good plays there. I was not expecting Sucker Punch on Hitmonchan. I mean Hitmon Top. So good plays there. I was not expecting it. Um, really, Metachan wasn't going to do much rest of the match anyway. Could deal with the Venusaur, which now gives us problems. Venusaur now is a problem and a pain in my boot. Drain Punch, he's not defensively invested at all. So we just sit here, 64. Um, so we just take out him on top. Nice. There, I was. He's not defensively invested. He had to be no defense invested. Because that was, what, 52%? He had to be no defense invested, no HP invested. He's got to be max special defense, max attack, I bet. And, a and I bet spore speed. So um, that made him just... So we put that risky. If he was out speeding us, we would have lost. So uh, that was good. But we got our HP back. We're sitting at 64% now. I don't know what comes in here. Uh, Volcarona could set up, I guess. Volcarona, I am choice banned into this. So Volcarona can come in and set up, and that's not great. Uh, we can Venusaur. All right. We're locked into Drain Punch. Venusaur. Mega. Defensive. Uh, we're doing 23%. So I think I just... I'm going to go Drain Punch. Just to see what he does. I didn't think it would kill. But it gives us a little bit more staying power. Synthesis. Alright, so he's going to try to synthesize up. Um, dealing with Mega Venusaur. Um, best way, I could, this is now the Gyarados Sweep, I think. The Gyarados Sweep Show. Is what is Venusaur doing to... I think this is the Gyarados Sweep Show, my friends. I really do. Gyarados. On a, uh, that's the Mega Gyarados. I don't want a Mega yet because the, I don't want a Mega this match. Uh, Venus Mega. So he goes for, uh, 
we or earthquake he's gonna be at 50 oh this is not good Garchomp what do you do Mega, Mega Venusaur uh, sitting yeah Garchomp is the play don't but he could go Giga Drain Giga Drain isn't good Nine Tails, what are you doing here? Mega Venusaur is a pain in my butt. Venus Mega. Nine Tails. We are doing uh, 27%. I can hit Hypnosis. That's what the play is. Nine Tails, you're in. That's fine. I gotta get I gotta get the hypnosis. So I hit hypnosis, whatever comes in doesn't want to take it, so that's nice. Nine tails can put some work in. Glad I got the hail off because I don't want to take the residual damage every turn. But this thing is sitting at 49. I really need it to be down in like the twenties. But it comes back in, it takes uh, thirty-seven it to be down to like thirty not thirty, it takes about six percent. So it would be sitting about 40%. Uh, Rackman comes in here. Do I get the uh, the sleep? I miss. Great. We outspeed. What are we doing to a Rackman in? Uh, I think it's the Sticky Web lead. That's the set I think it is. It does a lot and we die. So that is great. Um, that is real great. So I, I can let you go down. I could get Freeze, um, but I want to damage it. Oh no, we don't beat it now. I needed to get damage, so Psy Shock is the play. Did you really just magic coat me? What does magic coat even do? I don't even know. I'm gonna look that up real quick. Magic coat. <laughs> I don't even know. I think it blocks um, status moves. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, you thought I was going to bring hypnosis, do hypnosis. No, I'm going to let this thing go down. That's the play. I don't care about you and your magic bounce crap. Oh, we live. We're hitting at 14% now. Bro. Bro, 14%. We've won with... Nine Tails, you did not just do this. <laughs> oh, bad play. Bad read, my guy. Bad read. You thought I was going to go Hypnosis. So now Volcarona is the easy play. Come in here. Uh, we get set up with Gyarados. That's, we win. So Garchomp didn't get to bring anything. Volcarona comes in, does half its damage. Uh, Alright. Now this is, I think we go Mega Gyarados here. Unless, what is... You don't have anything to deal with it. You could go lock an Earthquake Hitmonchan. What is that Hitmonchan doing? Hitmonchan, Volcarona, Volcarona, uh, assume it's going to be plus one, oh, that do uh, too much damage, so it's got to be Gyarados, I think, can Gyarados hit it from 50 and take it out, that's the, pl that's the real question, Gyarados, um, Volcarona, Volcarona from 50, it can with Waterfall, so Vol Gyarados is the play. 100% Gyarados right now. Good thing Intimidate. Giga Drain. I stay. I'm gonna keep the uh, non-Mega form. Gear. That's his best way to hit me right now. And if I go plus one, I take him out any, every time. So Dragon Dance. Oh ho ho. All right, you're gonna make me kill you now. That's fine. I gotta go. I gotta go hit him. I gotta hit him now. I gotta check this. I just let him hit plus one. Uh, plus one special attack. Um, Giga Drain. How much Giga Drain do? Twenty-two percent. Let's get rid of Roost for Giga Drain. Did twenty-eight percent. So that's probably. It's not. How is that not doing that much? Uh, cause it's plus one. If he's not plus one, neutral, uh, 20, 
He could have got pretty close to a max roll there. Uh, possible rolls. Uh, yeah, he probably got an 81 roll there, so that wasn't too great. Uh, we can still take out a waterfall. Fire blast. Ooh, -hoo. that's fine. So now it's Gyarados and Venusaur. Venusaur at 37. Uh, Gyarados sitting at a plus one on Venusaur. Mega. 37. Uh, that's. I mean, Mega, he's doing 44. I think Mega gives me the chance. If I'm plus one Gyarados, if I am plus one Gyarados on Venusaur Mega, uh, Earthquake is doing, Crunch is doing actually more. So I go Mega and Crunch. I go Mega Crunch. And that'll be it. Good 4 0 victory versus my guy. My guy here uh, played a really good game, brought some really cool tech. So uh, we'll take another 4-0 victory there, increasing our differential to 22, I think, on the season. So we are really stacking up that differential bonus there, trying to keep a shot in the lead. It comes down to a lot of really weird numbers right now. So uh, if people lose and I went out, I can get that number one spot. Don't know if I won it or not right now, but uh, I can get that number one spot. So. That's where we're sitting. We got a nice 4-0 win. Uh, good match versus Neurotic Neutral Gaming and his Rhode Island Radicates. If you did enjoy him, he's a great guy. Real hoot. Uh, real hoot and a half, actually. Quite a great guy. His link to his channel is in the description down below. You're going to want to go check him out. Go support him. Give him some luck with the rest of his season. He is one of those coaches looking at playoffs this week. So um, he's putting it really closely to... he's. Playing that fourth spot really close. Uh, Tui has a chance to take it from him this week. It's going to be a nice tight race going into the final couple weeks here. Uh, the first place spot is highly contended. The fourth place spot is highly contended. So there's a lot of really great contentions going on right now. So you're not going to want to miss a thing. So hit that subscribe button so you never miss an episode of PDL, especially from my perspective. And I know all the stats and stuff because I am the commissioner. So you're going to want to do that. Make sure you do leave a like if you did enjoy as well. And then, as always, check out my opponent in the description go give him some support he's a real great guy and you're gonna love him as well but that is where i'm gonna wrap it up today we take a 4-0 win here in week number eight giving us a nice six and two for the season i believe giving us a nice no it would give us a nice five and two because we didn't battle week three week four so it'll give us a nice five and two on the season which is looking pretty nicely we're sitting at that nice two spot right now so give me some luck Give me some hope. We're going to try to go nine wins straight out to win this championship. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you did enjoy it. Until next time, my name is ChaosMay006, and I am signing off. So as always, stay safe and burn it up.